Streets are a really good inroads. It kind of gives you a, a little taster. It's a community taster. <laughs> uh, what actually is going on out there? And, and then you come and you experience it and you go, oh, this is a vibe. This is the vibe <coughs> of the community. This is pretty much, we have a you know, light structure, but um, it's very devotional like this. In our community, we don't watch quite as many movies as we watched in the last couple of days, but we watch them pretty consistently. And people come in all kinds of ways. Uh, Nikita flew in, was that how many years ago? Two years, two years, ago. Two years ago. A little more. Yeah. Like two years and four months. <coughs> yeah. I'm here. I'm here to stay. Yeah, I came here and I was I knew I was in Kong anyway, so yeah, and so I just stayed. Yeah, and, and the thing is when I came here I had no idea what I was going into. <laughs> not, not in the way like I like in the way that I really did know what it is. Like I didn't like I didn't even know who David was to be like I really did not know. I, I learned everything here. All I knew that it was very clear for me that I was, like, I felt like my whole world was changing, right? I was, I let go of the whole world, and the next, I can't even call it a step, and it's like the next world appeared, and it was here. I was to come to Utah, and I was even guided not to even ask any questions. It was clear. I was guided to fill out an application. David called me the next day, and two weeks later, I came. And uh, from there on, it was like, you'll find out everything here is just like everything. And it was like, the feeling was I came into a different world and I had to learn of it every day. Every task that was given, every single meeting, every single like um, encounter, it was all for me to learn of a new world, to learn of a new way, to learn of, of a new me. Because I knew like there's something that's, like, there's a deep desire to know who I am, and I couldn't live without knowing myself anymore. And I knew that I have to know, capital M, myself, capital S. And so that was the experience. And so it's just like, sometimes people ask me, like, what is it like to live in the community? And I say, I don't know. Because the experience is just, it's just the experience living it's just everything is new like to the point where I would wake up like especially then it just became more and more so I would wake up every day and I'd be like I don't know anything like I like I don't know who anyone is it's like you know if you guys have seen 50 first dates and then spirit <laughs> it's like where am I who am I who what's going on and then I would just like hear like stay with me and then I'll hear st spirit interpreting like everything. This is where you live, this is what you do, this is like, you know, this is, this is so and so, this, you know, just like really thoroughly, like really interpreting the world, interpreting everything for me and that's just become an experience and, and it's like just I'm living in this new deep deep experience and it's like that's that's all i know and then so yeah that's just been the journey and just like deepening into the unknown deepening like you know there's no like the beauty of it there's no ever like technically i've known some you know some of the seeming people they're not people <laughs> Uh, for two years, but there's no sense of like, oh, I know you, this is like, that's David, that's Kirsten, you know? It's just like, every day it's like, I don't know, it's like spirit, it's like the desire is to know spirit and to hear spirit, and so everything that comes, it's like, that's spirit, and, and the beautiful thing that the ones that are given, I'm like, I'm so grateful, because I, I, I'm like, these are the ones where I can... For somehow through them, the spirit is recognized very easily. It's just, it's just easily. I don't have to sit there like, is it spirit? Who is it? It's like, who else could it be? It's like, meeting, you know, the love of your life all the time, right? And so there's no like that casual familiarity. It's like, and every day it's just like, yeah, everything is new and deep and exciting and with sense of sometimes a little bit like, because <gasps> you don't know, right? And uh, and on the other hand, it's just like 
the sameness of like the depth, you know, because there's still a lot of movement seemingly, but the depth is the same, the same, like that deep vibe, deep forgiveness, deep presence that's just deepens and deepens and deepens and deepens and it's just like lately I've been having experiences of just falling and I'll, sometimes I'll wake up and I'll hear today I'm just going to fall and I'll have these like experiences that I'm just falling and that's, it's great, it's great <laughs> and it's just like, kind of like the abyss, you know, just falling and it's like, <gasps> you know, and then while I'm even falling it feels like I'm still being very tightly held, held very tightly. It's not like I fall and crash. It's like, no, I'm very tightly held in the love. And it's like, that. I said, that's all I ever wanted. That's, that's the depth for me, just feeling that, like, I'm so tightly held in the love. And so, so that's my community experience. <laughs> <laughs>